G'day YouTube. This quick video will show you how to list your partitions in Linux Mint. Now you can do this one of two ways, either A through the terminal or B through a GUI graphical interface. So open up a terminal and type in sudo fdisk l for list. Throw in your password and you'll see a list of your uh, partition drives there. I have three there, SDA 1, 2, and 5. As you can see, this is the booted one. It's got a little asterisk to denote that. And um, the graphical way, which is a much more informative way to do this, is uh, through typing in sudo gparted. And if it's not installed, which evidently it's not on mine, type in sudo apt-get install gparted. Wait for that to load up. That shouldn't take too long. Now, when you do actually uh, open this program, you do need to open it as uh, the super do user, the, the root user. So you do have to type in sudo gparted in terminal to open it up, unlike, for example, a music player like Rhythmbox or Firefox. So, uh, yes, that is important. Now, when this gparted does load up, uh, oh actually, first of all, I'll let you know that gparted starts, stands for GNOME Partition Editor. So I'll just um, sudo gparted, wait for that to load it up. There we go. Actually, that was quite quick because there isn't many uh, partition drives on the uh, on the disk. Uh, as you can see, the uh, the mounted point, this is the one I'm currently using. This is the Linux Mint. It's on S uh, dev SDA1. Hence the mount point, point. You can see the uh, it's the root folder there, um, and the other ones are swap drives, some unallocated space, things like that. Now, uh, gparted is actually also a live distribution, as a just a live disk really. Um, that's useful because gparted in when using it in Linux Mint, you can't actually uh, resize uh, partitions uh, unless you've actually booted it as a live distro because since uh, this Linux distro, Linux Mint, is loaded up, which means it's mounted, so it can't be resized and changed. I can't affect any changes here whatsoever, so I have to really use the uh, gparted live distro, or any distro that includes gparted on it. So that's pretty much that in a nutshell, and it's very helpful. The most helpful thing you'll ever come across is a, a live bootable distro that uh, allows you to switch, switch up, change, delete, resize, all of that do all that stuff and partition on your drive. Okay, uh, that's pretty much it in a nutshell. Just a little bit of information on that one, and uh, I hope that's been of some use to you guys. Cheers.